Richard, the first game finished in a quick draw. Were you not in the mood to fight? Yeah, after yesterday, I kind of... Uh, yeah, I'm still there, pretty much. So I kind of figured, okay, I just want to, you know, finish the tournament and just go home. Yeah, I played already, like, this is my third tournament in a row. So, and also, I, I desperately needed the rest day. I feel like my uh, play dropped dramatically. So I figured, okay, it's a good way to make a rest day. Um, yeah, that's it, pretty much. So I thought you missed a little bit Armageddon's, you know, to have all this, you know, fights and... Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's very cruel, right? Because you're getting, I mean, I am getting one third of a, of a point, basically. Yeah? But on the other hand, I mean, okay, uh, what to do? This is the, this is the, things are a bit strange here, I mean, but this is the format, yeah? So this is what we signed up for, in a way. So, okay, I played this Armageddon. Yeah, I mean, I felt like I, at one point probably I was pawned up, so I don't feel like I was doing too badly. But, uh, like I've said, I have, like, you know, zero energy left, so I just uh, I just started missing things one after the other, and then, um, well, uh, my position collapsed pretty quickly. Yeah, so. yeah, actually, at one point on the move 17, instead of knight e3, did you consider knight takes f7? It's a computer move, of course, but did, have you thought about it? Yeah, it's possible. I mean, of course, knight f7 is always, you know, a motive in these positions. But like I've said, uh, I just, you know, uh, like, uh, I just wanted to finish the day as soon as possible. And my plan is the same for tomorrow. But okay, my opponent, I am black, so you know my opponent might be uh, more ambitious. Let's put it this way. Yeah, Richard, you know that Magnus always fights for the first place, no matter what, and he is from this type of people. Um, are you ready to give him this victory so easily, or you are going to fight still? Okay, it's also you know depends on uh, our opponent. I mean, uh, I I really feel like you know I maybe tomorrow it will be different. I will you know I didn't prepare at all today, so I just took some day off from chess. And okay, for tomorrow obviously I will be you know more prepared. But overall, yeah, this tournament been really long, so what to do? Yeah, we'll see how it finishes. Yeah, and you know many people write very nice comments supporting you in social media, for example, of Norway chess. We see them all the time. Do you feel this support? Uh, do you see all these comments? Not really, no. I mean, the only person I'm uh, talking to is my wife. Of course, she gives me a uh, enormous uh, joy and support. Uh, okay, not only here, but like in life, yeah, throughout uh, our time together. So uh, whatever uh, you know, I have, you know, achieved, or you know, it's uh, mostly because uh, of her making it possible. As I this, I don't really um, uh, go to social media. I don't spend time on the internet and stuff like that. So. Yeah, I'm you know living my life in kind of a bubble, yeah, <laughs> away from this thing. So, okay. The best of luck for you, and we're still hoping they're gonna be an interesting fight in the end. Thank you, Richard.